Hi guys, this is Combo Fishing USA. You are watching another video of Combo Fishing USA. I'm here at the marina. As you can see behind me, there's boats, you know, docks there. And we try to catch up bluegills. I want to show you guys how to tie two uh, hooks in, in, in this line, okay? Put two hooks in there. Uh, so let me show you how to do this, okay? So this is line right, here, right now, okay? What you should do, that's how you do it, okay? And then you go around like that. You see this? Okay. Now you get the loop there, okay? So the next thing you do, run this line through the loop here. You could do it maybe 8 to 13 times, okay? Uh, like that, okay? You see that? But do it the more you do it it's better to have a tank of free, tank of free line okay when you fish so i prefer have maybe 13 or 14 loops around here so i keep going like that okay keep going 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 so when you feel like you're satisfied with it and what you should be doing you hold the line like that okay you hold one tip and that tip there okay just a little bit like this okay now you pull it through you see the line now okay you got this knot okay see it real knot now you got the you can tie the hook like like this okay now let me show you this this is a single hook right now you got one hook one line hook here okay see that now I'm gonna try this have you more okay one more line one more line of the hook okay so what I'm doing I go like this same thing same uh, steps do the same thing go around like that okay okay it's the same thing uh, you run this many loops as you want okay like me I just keep going going until I feel like it's it's uh, I want it, okay. So I keep going like this, you know, make it faster, you guys. So that when you go back to catch a blue gear, you don't have to buy, you know, you bought, uh, you have to, you don't have to buy uh, a thing from the store that had two hooks, you know, in one line, okay. You could do this, okay. You could put, you could tie as many hooks as you want. If you follow my, uh, you know, like step here, okay, you can put. Uh, 10 15 hooks in, in one line, okay. It depends on the law, they allow you to do it, okay. So, the same thing, too, okay. You pull like that, okay. Now, you see this same thing, okay. There, okay. But sometimes you have to wait a little bit, so make sure the line is it's really running smooth, okay. Now, you got all this knot here. Look at this, you got this tank of free line, okay. You see, use this line like that, okay. You can cut this and tie up one line straight down or you can use these two lines together okay so this is what I'm showing you today I'm using a six pound test line called P line okay and uh, and the ugly stick what the hell? okay and this is what uh, I've been using okay you see right now that's what I, I've tied up like this you see the line okay it's not tangled, okay? But when you put the hook or the bait there, you know, it's it's like this, okay? You see? It's straight up like this. If you want to put down the hook trees in, in, in the bottom there, if you can, okay? You put the split shot here, the lead here, right here, okay? You put the hooks here. So now you've got three hooks in there now, okay? So this I'm going to try to show you uh, how, how, how to tie up two hooks in one line so that you don't have to spend money you know, become more expensive when you lose it. You know, each time you cast, become more expensive uh, when you spend money on uh, the rigs, what they call the rig, I think the two uh, hooks there, okay? So, this is what I want to show you how to tie two hooks. You can add another hook in front on, on, on the line here, but this two, I mean, that's too small, it's six, like it's hard to see. That's why I'm using another sample of a you know, bigger line and so that to show you, okay? All right, guys, I hope you, you like it, and I hope that you uh, subscribe to uh, my channel to see uh, more tricks and uh, catch and cook uh, next time, okay? All right, thank you, and let's go.
catch some bluegills, okay? Oh, you hope. Can be pretty good on YouTube. See that? It's biting. See that, my friend? My poor star got double. Uh, yeah! <laughs> As you can see, my friend, I got doubles, okay? okay? First time double. But now, very big one that we cannot keep, but hey, it's pretty good excitement, okay? To see both fish landed at the same time. One gone. Oh, that one died, I think. Oh, I think the small mouth tried to bite them, though. See that? They missed them. All right. Oh, gone. Here we go. Oh. That's big. That's big. Oh my God. That's big. That's big. I made a two. Ooh, got two. Ooh, two. 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 <laughs> I got two. You got. Oh. I got two. I got two. I got two. I got two. Two big one. Big. Oh my god. See look my friend. Big two big bluegills, okay? Here we go. Oh another two. Here we go. As you can see my friend. Second row. Second in a row. Look the right. we go. Say hi, my friend. There we go. Woo! Oh, my God. My first time. This is my slab crappies, okay? All right. Check it out. Come on, check it out. There we go. Yeah. Yeah, let's try it. A small one. No, it's good size. Ain't small. I can't bite and look. Oh no. Just. Oh, this one's swallow. Oh no. Just right there. What are you trying to change? Hmm? Here we go. I have one more, I think. This one's a pretty good sign. Look at that. It's a big, big name. Look. It's getting big now. There we go. There we go. Come on, come on. Uh, uh. What the hell is that? Uh, my lines look thing up. Whoo! Finally, after three. 385 years, my friend. Just cut this one. Okay. <coughs> it won't go nowhere after secure hook. Here you go. Ooh, that's big. I feel like big. That's big. That's big. Could be a walleye. A small one. La oh my god, I got a fur. Lamborghini. <laughs> no, you cannot keep. No. This fish has to be 12 inches, about 30 something inches. So this is what? Oh. Alright, I hope I don't break my line, okay? Alright. No, on the side. All right, there's a light mouse, big fat light mouse. Okay. See, when you have the fish calling, yeah, the fish start coming. All kind of fish start coming, my friend. Except walleye. As you can see, it's smally. Okay. I should have my go uh, fish brain on it. The mark. Oh. <laughs> it's get dirty. Here 
Here we go, my friend. I got two. Ah, that ball, that ball, that ball, that ball, that ball. Oh, good sign, my friend. As you can see, that ball, okay? That ball, that ball. Double header, okay? This is cooking with Combo Fishing USA. Today I'm going to show you how to make freshly catch bluegill sweet and sour soup, okay? This is what you need to make this soup more delicious, okay? First you need tomato, gourd, lotus, pineapple, and radish and also bluegills, freshly, freshly catch bluegills and you need uh, basil leaf, onions, long core rinder and also rice patty herb and garlic and also we need, I just put uh, lime leaf in the water or in boiling water with uh, galanga roots, okay, called galanga roots, okay, so this Put this about maybe like five, ten minutes with this galanga and lamb leaf, okay? Maybe ten minutes just. And then after you put the lamb leaf, galanga roots in there, blue gears. And then lotus. And then you put pineapple in there too. Pineapple. Okay. And then radish. Cook them together, okay? To make it, to make it more flavorful. Just stir it up a little bit. Let's cook this about maybe uh, five to ten minutes, okay? I'm gonna add uh, two tablespoons of tamarind. Okay. And then three or four tablespoons of soy sauce and two teaspoons of sugar don't put too much okay the, yeah, the sweetness might be come from the, uh, the pineapple you know and then last is salt okay just one and a half Spoon, okay, you stir it up together and let it cook together about five minutes. Okay, two tablespoons of chicken, chicken broth mix. Okay, chicken broth mix. Okay. And the next one is tomato. You have tomato. Just put them all in there. Let me test a little bit. It's good. Next is fine garlic. I just put a little bit of oil in there, okay? Just go like this. You put basil, leaf, green onion, okay? 
and rice patty up, okay, and also long corridor, coriander, okay, coriander, all together. Now it smells delicious, my friends. Stir them up. There are two different ways to cook this, okay? Uh, I will show you the next video uh, how to cook, uh, you know, this sour soup again, okay? Sweet and sour soup again. Pour this on into this uh, soup, okay? Okay, done now, okay? Now it's time to eat. If you go to the Chinese restaurant and buy this, you know how much it costs a bowl of, of this soup? Sweet and sour, it's $50, okay? And this is how to make your own freshly cut uh, fish, any fish, okay, with this soup, okay? But I'm going to show you another video or part two of this uh, catching, okay? So, you know, it's not just a bluegill fish that you can do with this kind of soup, okay? But some people, they like to put the shrimp on it. I hope you like the video. Please don't forget to subscribe to Combo Fishing USA, okay? Thank you. I will see you next video.